Yo, Said, what are the most important things that people need to know whenever they try to run Armory? The first tip is spawn points. They need to uh, learn the spawn points, you know, because otherwise they wouldn't know where's the enemy yeah. at the beginning of the match. That's the main reason why they die in the beginning of the match, because I see a lot of comments they were complaining about. Yeah. Yo, I just died in the 15 seconds in the Armory. Yeah, yeah. That's why, because they don't know the uh, spawn points. There's a spawn tower right across the river. So like, as soon as you spawn, you usually kill them, as you see. Jesus. Uh, these two guys down. I only heard one. I didn't hear him right on. One more footstep, one footstep. Oh my god, bro. I literally walked into that nade. What the frick? Killed by the ones that spawned near us, you know? Yep. And when I checked your POV, I just saw that there's a river we cannot cross, but you are covering that, you know? Mm -hmm. People just let you need to learn the map, yeah. spawn points. The spawn points are the main thing in the game. Yeah. The main thing in the armory, by the way. Mm -hmm. I'll show the spawn points. They need to know where they spawn and where the enemies are, possible spawn points. Yep. And they should know where they can rotate and where their enemy can rotate. Yeah. These are many things, by the way. This guy's uh, in gas station, I'm pretty sure. What? Yeah. That's on, the left, on the left, on the left, on the hill. That's from Marshall. That was from Marshall. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Was that a bot? No, no. no. That's a player. Me? I thought I was a bot on that hill. That's why I didn't shoot him. Second yeah. one, gear. Second mm -hmm. one is gear. Mm -hmm. When we were spawned first match, I was playing with a gear I don't feel comfortable uh, because I was literally overweight at the beginning of the match because I was using some heavy armor, yeah. helmets, and gun. That's why I just had to die, you know, because I was not able to move as freely as I wanted to. Yeah. That's one of the main things. When I checked my POV, I just saw that. Actually, I was also feeling that by playing. I didn't feel free. Yeah. And when I tried to rush him, I wasn't able to jump as high I usually do. Mm -hmm. I couldn't jump. I couldn't run as fast as I wanted. Yeah. So that's the main thing. I had died there. I'm rotating to you guys now. I think I they might be rotating there, right? behind us. Nah, I said you should have him. He's close. What? Yeah, it's shot. Yeah, behind that, behind that, um, behind the... I got him. He's not even wearing a freaking... He's dead. One more, top, 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 top of the bridge. 110, 110, 110. He might need me, he might need me here. That's a sniper, sniper. That's a sniper, sniper. All right. I'll do. Do you think that was all of them? Both sides, huh? Very interesting, that's one of Nah, there's guys in gas station, I'm pretty sure. What? Yeah. That's on the from left, the hill. On the left, on the left, on the hill. That's from Marshall. That was from Marshall. Yeah. yeah. Also, only yeah. level 4 is usable because all, even scavs are using tire tree ammo. Yeah. Also, the sniper scavs have LPS ammo mm -hmm. in their mozins. Yeah. And they can literally one shot you from body. They have a special barrel. Yeah. It has some extra damage attributes. So they can just literally one, one tap you. I didn't even body. know that, that they had a special yeah. barrel. And they shouldn't use ammo below tire 4, because mm -hmm. even scales are wearing tire 4 ammo, tire 4 gear, I mean, and most of the ammo can, cannot even penetrate it, you know? I highly recommend that them to use MAD, mm. that can literally penetrate it. Yeah. If they are going to play with 5.56, A1 ammo, it cannot penetrate it. They need to, like, hit them two or three times. Even in the head, you know. So, so those are the min those are the minimums, basically the minimum bullets that they should. Yeah, use. yeah, yeah. These, yeah. These are the minimums. Yeah, yeah. These are the minim minimums. That's my nades. They're in front. There's two, three. He's up. He's up. I can see. I got one of them. Yeah, there's another one. Nading, nading, nading. Two nades actually. Three, three nades. I killed one. Killed two. Killed two. Hold on, that's all done. Third one, they shouldn't underestimate the scavs because mm -hmm. these are not like the bots in other games, you know. These are literal scavs. They guard the map and they can be dangerous. Most of the time, I die to scavs, you know. They, they shouldn't underestimate them. If they are playing with high MS, high ping, they need to pick them carefully. Otherwise, it can be punishable, you know. How would you explain the scav mechanics though, the scav behavior? What, what are the general tips? Because obviously, these scavs are elite scavs, right? So they have a, a basic mechanics that 
that that happens all the time in a random basis. You know, how, how would you explain the scabs in Armory? If they're playing in bunker, they shouldn't wait for the scabs to come to them. They should go to place where they are going to loot and clear the scabs there. And they shouldn't just rush them, you know? If they're, especially when they're playing with high ping, they need to pick them real quick, you know? If they don't do that, they can still get shot from scabs. That's kind of broken, not one of them. Yeah, yeah. And they need to trust the scabs when it's come to get some information, you know? Because yeah. they can see through walls. They can literally tell you that if there's an enemy. Footsteps 105, I think that's bot. I'm trying to yeah, get some info. Yeah, there are you know, nobody, nobody else. I'm trying to get some info. I don't see anything right now. Is that a I real player? Know. I'm going to trash you right now. On me. Oh, oh for me. gold lion. Here we know. go, chat. You can keep that, bro, if you want. Jesus Christ. I'm coming, sir. What are the what are the things that people really need to pay attention when they when their main goal is to loot in armory? They should check AK one hundred two mm -hmm. and FAL. They could be carrying some fire four ammo's, pretty expensive. And if they see a scab with RPK, they should just pick it up, you know, because it always has some DP in it, yeah. which is tier four. They should know the where the safes are. They should rotate depending on that, you know. Ah, so, so your yeah. rotation route every time then is to just go to where the safes are and then work your way around the bunker based on where the safes uh, if, are. If if there's no one in the bunker besides us, yeah. we always do that. Yeah, if there's okay. an enemy, they should, they should rotate on the enemy. No, that's a skill, that's a skill. Okay. I'm just going to follow you guys to like to show people where the rotation starts are. This is basically, um, this is one of the earliest safes that you can get in, a, in, in the map. So as soon as you come in from, um, as soon as you come in from this entrance on the left, guys, there's like a hallway down here and then you turn left and it's a second door on the left here and then it's a safe here there's a computer there's a computer right here cpu i was literally just about to say you can get cpus from this for like 8k and then there's a there's a jacket here always search jackets guys it's so easy to find um keys from there it's a suitcase here yeah and then like even gym bags King the other day found a freaking gold bar in here. So that's like what 10k, 20k for a gold bar from a gym bag? 50. 50, 50 there you go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously they're very rare, but if you're in armory, why not? Oh, you guys haven't seen upstairs yet. I'll, I'll show you upstairs. This is basically MTB Cribs, guys. Welcome to my crib. MTB Cribs. <laughs> Damn, how the F are you all doing this? Because they do this every day, mate. Like, these guys are putting the work, putting the hours to understand how everything works in this place. Every day, all day, you know. Every day, all day, literally. So this is the um, control center. This is where you can find the switch for the lifeboat downstairs, the extract downstairs. And this is single time, single use only. Um, as soon as you, as soon as you use this, it's right here, guys. As soon as you use this, a timer starts. And then when it finishes, it's done. What if someone doesn't use the lifeboat? Does it still leave? Yeah, yeah. Right, there we go. It jets off on its own. And this room right here. How much is the key for this room? Which room? Um, weapon room. The one upstairs. 400k, right? Yeah, 400. Yeah, 400, 500k for this weapons room key. It's a red card. And then you can get like fully stacked weapons at the top. And then you've got some... you got some stuff in there as well that you can pick up. But honestly, guys, as soon as you get into this bunker, you're going to get lost. 100%. You're going to get lost a few times until you do it like... 30 40 times and then until then you might still get lost but you could just gotta keep doing it guys so like default they always spawn in this back left room over here unless you're like in the room then they like force spawn somewhere else usually you let them spawn there and then let's go so this is where they normally spawn guys right here yeah and then as soon as the as soon as they come in just pop them it seems Hello? like wood carbon has a gift for you you know Ooh, yeah. look at this guys God damn! It's raining loot! I got no space for this. So you guys might want to pick that up. That might that be a player. Be a player. Yeah, 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 I was just about to say that. No, no, no. no, it's not. I was about to say the same thing. Also, a bit of a tip for you guys. Um, when you've got a laser on and you want to pre-aim like this, try and not have your laser sticking all the way out there because enemies might see it. Point it on a wall yeah. like this and then just flick out whenever you see an enemy. So pre-aim doing this and then flick out. 
Whoa! Uh, he chose like that all the time. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> Yo! Yo, one of my first ever raids in Armory. And we got freaking naded by someone in the last 30 seconds. People were saying like, watch them get... Like, all the people were saying, watch them get naded. <laughs> and we actually got naded, dude.